Okay, welcome back to Open Topics, episode number 18. You might be thinking, really? Bring back this one? This is one of the, this is even like a longer break than the last one. Yeah, last video I did for this one was back in August of last year. That was six months ago. Yep. I have been thinking of doing Open Topics video for some time, but I couldn't think of exactly what to talk about. But this one, do something differently, because normally... I discuss like comic books mostly. This is the first one to talk about anime. Now there are three shows that announced basically like when the next season's starting up for this for these ones. The first one that I'm discussing is is it wrong to have girls on It was announced that there's gonna be a fourth season coming. Thank you. And it's coming next year. Cool. I hope it's more twelve episodes. Why? Because if you look at the length of these books, I mean, like, here's book 12. Yes, this book is roughly, like, a little over 200 pages. This is basically 230 pages. You could probably do this book in about five episodes this one. I'd say five at least. This one is actually the shortest book in the whole series. Yeah, I'm not kidding about it. This book is really short. This one you can do in just, let's see. This book is only like 213 pages. This one you can do presumably in about four episodes, I'd say. Four episodes might be good enough for this one. Maybe five. But when you get to this book right here, it has to be about eight, nine episodes. Because this book is long. This book is over 400 pages. Yeah, I'm not kidding about that. It is 417 pages. So you gotta at least have eight episodes of this one. Because this book is long and a lot of stuff happens in this one. So hopefully eight will be basically enough for that one. Alright, next one is a series I actually I should just did a rewatch for. How Not the Seven Demon Lord. Yep. Now all I heard about it was coming out this year. And then later on I found out it's coming out in April. Okay. Maybe a little information. And then we had a trailer come out. Yes, a trailer. Along with a release date. April 8th. I'm like, that's interesting. That comes out like roughly, I'd say about a week after My Hero, a little over a week after My Hero Academia Season 5 starts up. And like a week after the end of ReZero Season 2. Along with the ending of Black Clover and a bunch of our anime that I've been watching. So, get a return of this series, which is awesome. And it looks like, though, they could continue with Book 4, because that priest who pops up in Books 4 through 6 could pop up in the thing. So we can focus all on her for the, the, those episodes. My hope with this one is that, now in the case of Israel and Trigger's Dungeon, that one I want to see about, hopefully about 15, 16 episodes out of that one. In the case of this season, I'm hoping to see 24. Yes. Because I want to see adaptation of at least six books for season two. Because here's the thing. It's been three years since the end of the last season. And there's been plenty of books released since then. Like, go book four, continue from there. I wouldn't be surprised if they went to book seven. Because they were kind of started out in book four. So I would just go from book four. And I would stop not book seven, but book nine. Because I like to see... Like, the adaptation of of the weddings that happens in the books. Yes, there's two weddings that happen in the books. In book 7, Diablo marries Shira. In book 9, he marries Rem. I'm personally looking forward to it, so... I'll basically discuss it when the, when the anime comes out in a couple, like a little over a month from now. The other one is the second season of... Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid, which they call it Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid S. I'm not sure why they got the second season after war, but yeah, I noticed that for some seasons, like for How Not the Seven Demon Lord has it's called Omega for season two for Kutasu Kutopa with a double S, and for Miss Kumar Jackman it's a single S, and okay, so we have a release date now. As far as I heard last year was that it was going to be summer 2021. That's all the release date I heard for it. And then I saw the article from Crunchyroll that's coming out in July. Okay. Not that far off. That's like just a few months away. So not that long of a wait. No, not really. 
Though I would probably think that, given maybe how long some of the seasons are, now my Hero Academia probably still going on at that point. That, yeah, probably still going on. I don't think it'll be wrapping up at that point. No, I think it'll be still going on. In the case of How Not Some Evil, I hope it's still going on at that point. Though some of the other anime basically be watching still be going, going like Case Closed, One Piece Bar, so those are still going. But July is a really good date. And the thing is, like, the obvious question for season two is what chapters of the manga they're going to have? Because they adapted roughly about the first 44 chapters for the first season. Yeah, they skipped some chapters for, for the season. I wouldn't be surprised they went back to go and basically deal with those. Yeah. Now, I have heard also that in the summer of this year, we're going to get Miss, uh, not Miss, uh, Kagosawa Love Us War Season 3. That's presumably coming out this summer. But that's all I heard about. Miss Kamara's Dragon Man. Now, I did hear they replaced the director for the series because here's the thing. The reason why they replaced the director for Season 2 because the guy died in the in the studio fire that happened a couple years ago. So they replaced him with somebody else. I'm not really familiar because I'm not really familiar with all these anime directors. So, sorry basically if I disrespect you or anything. But it's kind of hard to pronounce these people's names because it's Japanese. So, I'm looking forward to see what they do for season two. Now, one thing at least I appreciate for the original season of the show and the studio that made it. The thing is, they actually took their time with this damn thing. And... It's done with a different mindset, basically. They have a set frames every day. Just basically do it on a timely schedule. Though, do I think it'd be 12 episodes like season 1? Probably. Yeah, this one I can see be 12 episodes. In the case of... Is it on Girls Dungeon? I'm hoping about 15. Hopefully not 12, because... Given the length of basically book 14... It needs to be longer than that, presumably... Maybe you can stretch the 20 episodes if you want to. It's possible. Just get the, get, the, get these books a lot of breathing room, please. Because the last season kind of cut a lot of stuff out of a book 11, which I was not appreciate that. So I'm hoping that the next season will be longer. I hope with that, but that's going to come out next year. But as for other anime's that release dates I'm looking forward to, well, they've announced. Uh, so I've had three I just named, which I did. I basically got info about that. Nothing much else. Yep. So yeah, that's it for this particular open topics video. In case you're curious about the other one, who knows? Depends on what I'm gonna do. Though, one thing I've been thinking of doing, and I want to talk to my friend Titty about this, I'll do a live version of this one. I'll probably discuss it maybe sometime in the future with him. By doing a live version of this one, we'll be discussing. Well, one thing I want to do, and I'm want to get his opinion on this one because he likes DC like I do. Basically, talk about new line of DC Infinite books and new creative teams. It's possible we could do it, but it all depends upon him. And we have to pick a date for it, and like who cover which series, and like discuss like what we think about the series upcoming and what we think of the creative teams because that's something I want to discuss with him because that's a big thing because that would take me a long to discuss because it's a long list of titles. Yep. But next video is going to be Seven Daily Sins, okay? Do the video. Bye.